My boy, what's the word, cuz? What up, Keon? I'm chilling. You was out here marinating or whatever that, that that thing called. It's called meditation, bro. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Listen, hey, we still finna hoop? Yeah, I'm, I'm down to hoop. I just finished my little workout and everything, so yeah. All right, bet. Call d -Lo, Let him know. I'm gonna meet y'all at the court. All right, I'll call him. All right, turn. <laughs> You need to be hopping on Indeed instead of my couch. Hello. Were you sleeping? Nah, nah, I wasn't sleeping. See, bro, I blame it on your gut health, bro. You got to get right with some of this vegan tomato soup I'm making. It's going to get you right. Yeah, I'm good on that, bro. Hey, bro, that's you. But listen, we finna hoop. I know you're trying to hoop. Go ahead and call Maj when you're ready, bro. We'll meet you at the court. And don't fall back asleep, bro. I'm telling you, don't. <sighs> So much. I hope you are not at home doing that stupid video thing. You know there's no real money in that. You have to stop. Just focus on your books. Focus on studying. Hey, Dad, I, I'm studying right now. Can we talk about this later? Okay, we could do that, but make sure you study hard, okay? Bye. <sighs> oh my god, what does he want? Maj, what up, my brother? Did uh, D-Lo call you? No. Yeah, I figured. Listen, bro, we about to go hoop, so if you're trying to hoop, pull up, and before you pull up, please wake D-Lo up, bro. Yeah, yeah, say less. I got you. All right, we're... Serious, bro? I'm telling you, my BM be on my back like she's my dad or something, bro. And my dad be on my back like he's my BM. Man, what took y'all so long? Let me find out y'all scared. Which one of you guys that I hit the game winner on again? <laughs> oh, you know, you gonna let him say that? I right, bet. Check up. Bet. Come on, Ma, shoot that tray. So oh my what? god. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Maj, I thought you actually had it. That's crazy. Come on, y'all remember when I tore my elbow ligament in high school? Come on. Come on. What's the word though? We about to get some food after this? Nah, I'm about to go get a cat. A cat? Oh, cat is actually crazy. Yeah, a cat. Y'all ain't know cats are actually spiritual beings, bro. You have to get right with cats. Man, they need to talk about a cat, bro. That means you have a good heart. It says something about y'all. Okay, here you go. Know what I'm saying? So y'all want to get Bro, they eat a Dalai Lama or something. Man, I heard cats eat their own owner. What the hell does dude want a cat for? Too ski. What is the word? It's your boy AOS, and today we're back with another episode. It's not even another episode. This is a start of a series, bro. Today we're starting one of the series I've been waiting to start for a minute. The boys, man. It's the story of four friends. They all grew up in San Mashuno, and it's all about their journey through through life together and separate bro like it's it's a good story bro it shows the evolution of people uh how friends change over time for the better and for worse i can't wait to show y'all this series bro but yeah man without further ado you guys already know what to do whether you're old or you're new make sure to like the comment and the subscribe button with that hey. So pretty much we're picking up right where the trailer ended right where the, like the beginning ended the cutscene. um and i'm super excited bro listen listen so we have four characters i'm gonna show you that their names um today we're gonna be going through like pretty much all their adventures um so we got first off start with the oldest my boy somebody ringing his phone somebody calling you keon i guess not but first we got uh benjamin right benjamin his nickname is bino uh, that's pretty much what we gonna be calling him throughout the whole thing bino but benjamin he's a really cool guy he's more so into like his spiritual vibe let me open up his profile real quick but yeah so he loves the outdoors he's a vegetarian he's active he has trust issues 
and he's gentle you guys are pretty much see i'm not sure why his picture's not popping up but you guys are pretty much see um how life's gonna play out for Beto. he has one of the more interesting storylines and because he has a couple of things to do today I'm going to I'm going to tell you guys more about Bino when we're going out with him, when we're going through because today he has to go grocery shopping. After grocery shopping, he has to he's going to buy a cat today, bro. I'm hella excited about boy buying a cat. Y'all know how big of a deal that is? He buying a cat, bro. Listen. If y'all know AC had a cat. I miss my cat, bro. Moon, I'm sorry, my boy. I miss my cat. I remember AC had a cat, bro. My cat gone, bro. He not he didn't pass away, but like AC had to make a tough decision. But don't worry, man. I'm gonna give me. I'm gonna give me a cat again. I miss. I miss my cat. But you know, it was for, it was for the better. But listen, we ain't, we ain't gonna talk about that right now. I ain't gonna get it. I ain't gonna get emotional. Cause you know what I'm saying. I'm, I'm pimping. I'm pimping right now. Pimping has been pimping. I can't be. You know what I'm saying. Getting soft on the internet. Who's gangster points for that? But next we have Keon. Uh, Keon. Let's go ahead and open up his profile. Um, Keon. He's a he's a really interesting character as well because he's the most different. I wouldn't say he's the most different exactly, but he has some of the more different things than any of the other um, boys have. And that's the fact that he's non-committal. He'll have some. <laughs> you guys will see who Keon relates to the most out of the group. Trust. Non-committal, party animal, goofball, and outgoing. Um, some of his likes and dislikes are here too. Uh, flirtation, intimacy, whatever. He's pretty much the F-boy. I'm not going to sit here and crack jokes with y'all. He's the F-boy. If y'all think any of my sims have ever been wildin' before, y'all have never met this man. This man is wild. He's wild, bro. He's wild. He's gonna be wildin' out the whole series. You know what I'm saying? So I'm excited. He's gonna be one of the fun ones to play as. Um, but yeah, man, listen. He been through a lot, and he's also he's also what's it called? He's also a drug dealer too. So he that's how he make his money. You'll see that he a little more, you know, he got a little more bread going on than the rest of them. You know what I'm saying? But that's because he's doing his things to make his money outside of um, the traditional job scheme, right? So that's Keon for y'all. I'll go more into his story later. Um, and then after Keon, we have Samaj. I can't wait to y'all, Samaj. Samaj, right? Great dude again. He's a goofball, outgoing, materialistic, party annual, and he's self-absorbed. Um, he's really, really into the content creating space, right? But he's in college. That's the last place he want to be. He don't want to be nowhere near college. And the only reason he's there is because his pops is literally forcing him to go. And it's like, Samaj, as long as you live under my roof, you're going to go to school. And Samaj, of course, like you see Samaj got bread. He got the whole gallery department fit on. You know what I'm saying? Paint splattered everywhere. He's saucied up. You know what I'm saying? But his pops is like, listen, if you don't go to school, all this is gone. He's basically, it's not blackmail. It's not, it's not. He's basically saying, you got to play by my rules. He basically like, I don't know what's the proper word for it, but he basically forced him to play by his rules. And that's not fair. He basically like, listen, if you want my financial support, you got to go to school. That's kind of messed up because it's going to create some serious unhappiness for Samaj because he's too busy forcing doing something that he doesn't want to do rather than actually pursuing what he does want to do. And that's content creation. So, um, yeah, we'll touch on Samaj's story a little bit today because he has to go to class later. Well, he has to go to the college campus, so we're going to follow him around the college campus, maybe get a little vlogging or something. That would be vibey. Uh, let me see. Then we got D'Lo, D'Angelo, 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 my boy. Now, listen, of course, Keon, like, Keon, you like fitness? I mean, I guess we'll say you like fitness. But yeah, man, you could tell D'Angelo is more like the rocker type. You know what I'm saying? He got more of the hardcore baggy sweats with the loose belt, Nike shocks, couple chains. He's tied it out. Um... But yeah, you can tell he's more like the rocker type. Again, he's non-committal. He's a bro. He's lazy and he's a goofball. Um, he's also a part of the boys as well. But he is a really good friend. He's a really good friend. He's a great listener. He's a great person to talk to. Um, as you've seen with him and Samaj during the cutscene, they were talking. He's a great person to talk to. He's a really good person. Um, so we're gonna dive into his story more because you guys seen somebody yell at him on the couch, telling him that he need to hop on Indeed instead of her couch. <laughs> She did, he needed to hop on Indeed instead of the couch. Also crazy. That's some nasty work. I'm not going to lie. I don't know if I can stand for an insult like that. I might have to go for, apply for jobs immediately. Because she was getting creative with that one. You need to hop on Indeed? Hey. <laughs> Shout out, Des. Thank you for voice acting that. But, um, yeah, really, though. Um, You guys will see more of his life as he got going on. He has one of the more complex stories. He's in a more difficult position than anybody else is in a group. Uh, they all have their things going on, but um, 
Yeah, he's in a completely different position than the rest of them. But you know, in the meantime, since I'm speaking of D'Lo, D'Lo, my boy, go ahead and ride the skateboard because he likes the skateboard too. Um, I think he might, I think he might get on bike, ride around on skateboard. Um, I think he might, what's it called? I think he might go to the skate park today. That might be somewhere that we make him go because he hangs around the skate park a lot. But he's lazy. Oh my god, boy, fast as hell. But he's lazy as hell. But you'll see, bro. He's lazy as hell, bro. Like he, the reason why his BM has, oh my god. How does it work? How does it work? How does it work? Oh my god, that's actually cool as hell. Oh my goodness. Yo. Oh my god. Yo, that's fire. What the wait, can we take the helmet off? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Can we take the helmet off? Because at the end of the day, hold on. Yo, I wish we could take that helmet off. I'm not gonna lie, that is fire. I didn't know this mod would have worked that well. Whoa. But yeah, man, he's the skater, as y'all can see. My boy loves skating. So um, yeah, he's just gonna enjoy the scene. And that girl that you seen walk past, that is his BM. I don't know what Aaliyah's doing at the um <laughs> at the park, you know what I'm saying? But that is his BM. Um, and we'll touch back on his bases later. Um, but as for right now. Samaj and Keon are here at the park. Bino, you got some stuff to take care of today. So we're going to head over to the pet store real quick. Let Bino go ahead and do his thing. My fault, my game is lagging right now. There's a bunch going on. So it's running kind of slow. My fault about that. But now we're going to end the meeting. Oh, not with Samaj. We're going to end the meeting, head over to the uh, pet store and get this new cat, bro. I'm hella excited. All right. So here we are at the Bayside Farmer's Market. Just listen to the name. Bayside Farmers Market. You know they only sell good foods over here. It's like Whole Foods. Y'all know how Whole Foods go down. You go to Whole Foods, you might spend two hundred dollars on some groceries, but they're gonna be some good groceries. Look at that. It's a nice little lot too. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I downloaded this from. I downloaded this by Buns Bun Sims Bun Sims Original by Simcrest. Um, I believe if you go on Bun Sims's Patreon, yeah though. You know what I'm saying? It's a cool little grocery store. You know what I'm saying? They got a nice little coffee area over there. Um, a lot of healthy food for you, you know what I'm saying? A lot of healthy food for people to get their shopping. Y'all gonna see beat on there a lot because Bino likes to shop for the best food and the best food only. Nothing but the best, you know what I'm saying? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna have Bino go over here, uh, purchase some products. I think I have to hit one of these two afterwards for Insemnia. Um, we'll do that afterwards. But the main thing is, um, Bino, he has a an interesting background man so he got into spirituality and kind of self-improvement and the wellness skill um because he got into a bad breakup bro it was a bad breakup like i'm, I'm doing a little grocery shop talk to y'all you know what i'm saying <laughs> it was a bad breakup bro it was a really bad breakup it was like one of those breakups where like they did you so dirty you don't know if you could love again y'all know what i'm talking about one of them one of them breakups where it's like damn i'm really good on relationships for a minute Y'all ever had a breakup really break up like that, though? The breakup's so powerful, you like, yo, I don't want to talk to nobody ever again. <laughs> yo, ever again, bro. Ever again. So he had to go through one of them breakups. You know, butter is $67? Nah, that should be illegal. But, um, yeah, he went through one of them breakups. It was a bad breakup, bro. It was one of the breakups that he really questioned himself. And he realized that there was a lot of like negative things he went through and a lot of negative things that he allowed himself to go through. He was a negative person, you know. So after the breakup, he really started working on himself. But that breakup was so bad for him. It gave him trust issues, even though he started working on himself, getting into meditation, the wellness skill and all that other stuff. Um, it became tough for him to fully let that past go. So he's still working on his healing journey. We're going to say that for Bino. Bino's definitely on his healing journey. Should I get some beers? Did I already get some? I ain't get no beers. You know, he don't drink, he don't drink, he don't drink, he don't drink, he don't smoke, by the way, too. No drinking, no smoking for Bino, he's, he's straight on all that. And he's still got some stuff to work on. He's still not fully ready to be able to trust yet, you know what I'm saying? He doesn't know if he's going to be able to trust anytime soon, bro. I'm not going to lie to you. Even though we know we shouldn't be drinking Gatorades. Gatorades is bad drinks, people. Don't drink that. Don't be drinking no dark sodas. Really, the only thing, I don't know if water is even safe to drink no more. I'm not going to lie to y'all. But pretty much water and tea, bro. <laughs> That's the only thing that's safe at this point. Water and tea. Everything else is everything else is is is, is tainted, bro. <laughs> everything else is tainted, bro. Everything else is tainted. Let me get some chips too. Almonds. You eating some almonds. Yeah, this dude's definitely vegan. He's vegan. He's into meditation. He's into all that. Uh let's see who's around here though. Uh, nobody's really around here. Oh, people shopping. 
and she's one of the the college girls. Oh, he, you're gonna see a bunch of college kids walking around. Uh, the college kids, those are the ones with the backpacks. You'll see them walking around. They'll either be shopping or in the city doing something. But just know they're one of the annoying college kids, bro. The college kids are super annoying. Samaj is one of the college kids, even though he don't claim it. He tried not to claim it. He's still a college kid. Hey, you better get the rest of them almonds. Oh, now they done. Oh, he a savage. He a savage. All right, back to the crib. Let's go ahead and order this cat like it's Amazon. <laughs> and then we good to go, no cap. So, I mean, now that we're back home, I think we should kind of unpack these groceries. But first, let me call, what the hell? Was, okay. <laughs> let me go ahead and call this uh, adoption agency. Let me see what's up with y'all, man. Is it me or do I always click the wrong thing? Call the adoption agency. Sell pet. Adopt a cat. Oh my God. I haven't done this in a minute, bro. Adopt a cat. I haven't shown you. Have I showed you Albino's house too? Oh yeah, I gotta show you Albino's house. But let's see. Let's see what cat is available. Oh my God, what's the Hilda? I said, what's this? Oh my God. Oh look at King. King look cool. Neutered. He's a male. Twinkinese. It's a tongue. Tongue. Whatever the hell. Sprinkles. Sprinkles. Yeah. Sprinkles. Spade. Okay, she's a Savannah cat. Socks. Hold on. How much can I adopt? I can adopt three of them at a time. All right. Let me get pumpkin. I think I'm gonna go with pumpkin. We got to find a different name for pumpkin, though. If y'all got a different name for pumpkin, please let a brother know. Because this is this is down by this is outrageous. Pumpkin. Are you serious? Pumpkin for a male cat? Is that is that them? Oh, that's them. They, damn, they delivered a the cat. Whoa. They del oh, OK. They delivered a cat quick as hell. What's up, little buddy? What's up, little buddy? Damn, this Amazon Prime with the shipment. What's up, little buddy? What's up, little pumpkin? <laughs> yeah, pumpkin. Okay, pumpkin, you looking good today. What do, what do we got to say? We got to accept it. We got to sign for the delivery. We got pumpkin. All right, are you sure you want to adopt this pet? Hell yes. Pumpkin. Now nah, we're not keeping his name pumpkin. We got to change his name. Apollo. Ooh, I like Apollo. Luke. Apollo, nice. Pudley. Ziggy. Balu or Batu? Balu. Sandy. Arlo, Shaky, Toby, Oliver, Ragtime, Piccolo, Yogi. I like Yogi though, because he brought into yoga. So I think Yogi would be fire. All right, Yogi it is. You added a pet to your household. Oh my God, shorty, get out of my house, man. I just got. Let's go. Welcome, little boy. <laughs> now it's time for me to tell you about one of our friends d -Lo. now d -Lo, right he is a he's a cool guy he is a great guy um as you can see he lives with his bm Aaliyah. Aaliyah ain't too fond of him <laughs> what's wrong with you you hungry whoa oh you on your you're on your your cycle okay let me get you right hold on so pretty much while Aaliyah's being a great mom we're gonna be trying to work on d -Lo getting this do you want to read her a story or sing her a lullaby or something? That'd be nice. Cause you know, she's a little, she a little, she'd be a little cry baby sometime. You know what I'm saying? Tell her a bedtime story. Tell her a bedtime story. See, look, she be, she on that crying stuff. That'd be a little OD. You don't gotta be doing all that shorty. I'm not gonna lie to you. Look, and you want to do do biting on your toes and stuff. Like, see, you don't gotta be doing all that. You don't gotta live that life no more. You know what I'm saying? We're grown folks. Come on, say, read her a bedtime story. But yeah, we're gonna be trying to grow this for D Lo. Um <laughs> while he sits here freaking brainlessly. Bro can't even cook nothing. On some crazy stuff. Look, they got baby pictures in the crib too. Look at that melon. <laughs> but uh yeah, man, we're gonna try to we're gonna try our best to try to get you right, bro. But at the end of the day, D Lo gotta realize the lady ain't the one holding you back. You're the one holding yourself back. Let's try to get her started on some dinner. Um a hundred hours? We been did that like twenty times. Come on. I mean, actually, what I really want her to do, I want her to talk to D-Lo, bro, because the whole episode, she gotta ask him where he was at earlier today. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, bro, if you was, get off the game, bro. Get off the game. She gotta talk to you, bro. Ask him where he was at, bro, because at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? If you was out working or trying to get some stuff done, argue about the relationship. Really ask him, like. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, hold on. What? Really ask him, like. Oh, y'all about to stand up and argue. I was about to get like that. Hold on, petty jab. Give him a petty jab too. 
Oh my God. What are you mad about this time? <laughs> what are you mad about this time? Um, I want to break up. Uh, yeah, I've been broke up. Um, and it wasn't your choice, buddy. So let's uh, let's remember that. All right. Uh, we've turned into the boring couple. We never woohoo anymore. I have needs. I mean, even though she want to, she's not ever gonna get to the point where she's like, "Hey, Dilo, let, let's try to work this. Let's try to, let's try, you know what I'm saying? Even if she's down bad in the trenches, the gutter gutter, she said she'll never do that again. We'll see. We'll see. Cause I know a couple people that go back when they worry. You know what I'm saying? You've been spending way too much simoleons. Not no cap. You've been spending way too much money on that game rather than trying to focus on your career or get some money. He's like, damn, why are you trying to come back? Oh, he's tight. Oh, he's not feeling it. That's all it took to get him tight. She's like, honestly, D honestly, D-Lo, I want to see you do better for yourself. You're just here doing nothing. You're wasting time on that game. He's like, you don't know what I'm trying to do, all right? I'm trying to work on this, on this business, on this rich mentality business. I got a rich mentality. You don't understand it, and I don't expect you to understand, Aaliyah. She's like, I don't got to understand it because it's not going to happen. You're not putting no work into it. And she, oof, that hurt. That hurt when the BM say that to you. Damn. And you know what? She just stunned on this man. And then she about to go, she about to go throw down in the kitchen on some, on some fettuccine Alfredo. Family size of four. You know what? You know, hold on, hold on. You know what? She's, she's pissed. She's pissed. Fettuccine Alfredo. You know what? Just cause you mad, make a plate. Because bro wanted to hop out today, not tell you where he was going, then come back like everything's smooth. Damn. Hold on, bro. Go talk to yourself in the bathroom. Go talk to yourself in the bathroom. Don't embarrass yourself like that, bro. Don't embarrass yourself like that. Go talk to yourself in the bathroom, bro. Try to calm down, bro. Don't embarrass yourself like that. Bro is very angry. Yo, you need therapy, my boy. Go talk to yourself in the bathroom, bro. Oh, my God. You letting her see you angry like this? Is he not embarrassed? He should be. A oh, he's tight. He's tight. He should be ashamed. He's like, I ain't going to let her talk to me like that. She don't know. What she know about rich mentality? She don't know nothing about rich mentality. She don't even got one. I watch. When my, when my brand blow up, though, watch. Watch when my brand blow up, bro. Everybody who says something bad about me, they're, they're going to regret it, bro. Watch, bro. Watch. <laughs> watch. Nah, but watch when his brand blow up, though. Watch when his brand blow up, though. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, hold on. You know what? Oh, she made that one plate. How are you feeling about the conversation? Oh, she got to use one of these and to use it. I think it's pretty much what I have to use, right? Wait, where is she going to use that? Oh, she goes into the bathroom? You know what? That is a genius idea. I love that. But D'Lo, you know what, bro? You don't have to stay for that, bro. You really don't. What does he have to spend it like Beckham? Look, it's my simoleons. <laughs> it's my simoleons, too. I can spend it however I want. I can spend on whatever I want. I want like a famous sim once said, what's the point of having it if you can't spend it? So stay out my pockets. <laughs> bro, you need therapy, my boy. Listen, bro, get out of here, bro. You don't have to stay here for that, bro. You gone. You gone. To call the Uber. We're going out to the skate park, bro. So while d -Lo's getting ready to go to the skate park, Keon's life looking a little bit different, bro. He chilling right now. He about to go <laughs> sit down, watch some sports. You know what I'm saying? Catch up on the TV a little bit. Catch up on the, in the sports world a little bit. And then he about to roll up, pull up a cup, and really. So now, this is the guy I want y'all to meet, Keon, bro. I'm not going to lie. He might be one of the most demon sims I have. He might. I'm when Y'all just haven't seen nothing yet. But just watch how bro get down during the series. But uh, this is Keon's house. This is the first character you guys seen in the little trailer. Uh, this is Keon's crib over here, man. He need a little bit of a TLC. But he live in the same apartment complex as your boy. All right, y'all can't see that, but as your boy D-Lo. So he lives in the same apartment as D-Lo. Um, and they sometimes come over. Sometimes uh, D-Lo will spend the night at his place because he don't want to sleep at his BM's house because she pissing him off. But in the meantime, um, yeah, Keon, he does his thing, bro. Like, he cool. He stay out the way. We get his money. He be dealing a little bit. But the only bad thing that bro really is trying to, I'm not going to say he's trying to work on Because if I said he's trying to work on it, it would be a complete lie. Um, the only thing that bro just got going on is that he just, he just love women, bro. He just love women like he's re he's really really he really loves women bro a feminist if you will <laughs> you're a feminist if you will. he just love women bro so sometimes he can't control control his little urges to want to you know you know what i'm saying uh, meet a girl he's working on that but bro is very much an addict i'm gonna go ahead and show y'all his traits have i show y'all the other traits i don't think so either way he's non-committal he's a goofball like he's a cool dude he's funny you know what i'm saying he's outgoing He's a party animal. He loves to party, loves to get lit, loves hanging with the ladies, 
One thing Keon going to do, because you see he racked up at the bottom over here. One thing he going to do, he going he gonna to blow a bag on Shorty. My boy is a certified trick. He a trick. I'm telling y'all. Hey, my boy, go ahead and go ahead and cheat. What are you angry about? No coffee. And he seen a rat. Yeah, he live in the hood. He live in the hood. So go ahead and go ahead and go ahead and like that, my boy. I want you to go ahead and chill a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Because he about to head out. He about to go take a shorty out. Because some, some girl was like, oh, Keon, I want to get my nails done. This and that, this and that. Keon, like, he cool. Like, you see my boy doing good. You know what I'm saying? He got bear brick in the crib. He doing good. So he's like, yeah, sure. Let me take you out to do your nails. And shit. You know what I'm saying? Just, just chilling because my boy be tricking for real. <laughs> hey, it's one thing. If it's one thing that ladies do, they love, they love a nigga that's going to spend. Ladies love a dude that's going to spend. And fellas. I'm not going to lie. There's no way around it, bro. You got to be able to drop a little money. You know what I'm saying? You guys got to keep it a stack, bro. You know what I'm saying? Hey, neighbor, I'm bored. Want to hang out for a bit so we can socialize and do whatever your heart desires? I, I know you're not in my crib right now, Gita. Gita, I know you're not in my crib right now. She's not, right? Is she at my door? Oh, she's at my door. Okay. This is the weird thing about Gita, right? This is also Keon's other neighbor, uh, Jade. Uh, This is the weird thing about Gita. She's the neighbor that lived down the hall. Keon smash. Now she want to just pull up every single day. Shodi, I'm about to pull up. Ain't that what what she want to be here for? Gita. I'm not gonna lie, Gita. Listen, I hit once. Go hang out with your son. How about that? I'm not that cool for you to want to be hanging around me 24-7 like that. Go hang around your son. You know what I'm saying? Like, look, my boy fried out his mind. Off the end, though, he's like, listen, uh, Gita, uh, you, you should probably go take care of your kids or something. I'm, I'm busy right now. I'm not going to lie. Maybe I'll call you one night. She ain't happy about that. Um, Should be all right. Oh, talk to her real quick. Talk to Jade. Like, Yo, Jade, drop the romance. Drop the romance. Flare on her. Hit it. Flare on her. Flare on her. Like, yo, like, yo, what up with you? I like that little hat you got on. You know, so you look mad good in that hat. Oh. Oh, she's not going. I'm flattered, but I'm not interested in that type of relationship with you. But I would be happy to be friends if you would like. I mean, she flirty. She just not feeling. My, but hold on, Keon, Keon, Keon. We'd be like, though, you know what I'm saying? Like, can I have your number or something like that? Oh, damn. She's not feeling you like that. Oh, um, this is embarrassing. I mean, at least you got other girls on the line. You know what I'm saying? She flirty, but she just not flirty for you, my boy. Small talk. Hey, welcome to the boys, Keon. Try starting a gathering. All right, whatever, my boy. Um, ask my career like, well, what you do for work, man? What you do for work? I like your little. Ass. She kind of swaggy though. Hold on, he said, "What's up, dude? You heard that?" <laughs> Hold on, let me see her swag though. Let me see her fashion real quick. My fault. I love playing with walls up recently. Um, so yeah, I've been I've been playing with it OD recently. I'm not gonna lie. No more no more walls cut away. No more walls down. Oh, she a cutie though. Oh no, nah, she a cutie though. Who's that? Oh, she's earthy. Y'all know how AC feel about the earthy women. She got their crystals on. Miss Meditation, hello. <laughs> Miss Meditation. You didn't tell me you was, you was, you know what I'm saying? You was in the halls and stuff, Miss Meditation. <laughs> All right, Miss Melon, I'm going to catch up with you then. All right, Keon got a cup over here. He about to pull up right in that cup. Pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. All right, stop talking to Shorty, man. Serious business about to go down. He's like, all right, cool, I'm going to catch you. Find out she didn't want to smash. Boy, don't want to talk no more. <laughs> Pull up that cup, my boy. Okay, hold on. Put in that inventory. Put in that inventory. And then right before you head out, because you about to go take that girl out, um, I want you to sit down here. Um, Sit down here and enjoy that cup. Enjoy that cup, man. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end, oh, he got five cups. Drink a cup. Drink a cup of that. That Waikiki. Oh, my God. That's what Moneybag was talking about. It's that Waukesha. He worry about that rat still. We got to get them rats out of here. Bye, man. Go ahead and sip that cup, my boy. Damn, he, he's gassed. He's fried off the Zaza and he's sipping that. Oof. Sipping that purple potion. Go ahead and call Shorty, though. Head over there. Like, yo, what up? You know what I'm saying? You want to you wanna go on a date or something? Like that? You still want to get your nails did? Hit it with that. Hit it with that, my boy. He's talking about Tina. And hey, y'all know Tina. If y'all been watching, if y'all been watching Ames Apartments, the Ames Apartments, y'all know Tina. I told y'all, there's an episode, episode two, Travis was talking to Brandon. He was like, listen, you know Tina got mad niggas. You know what I'm saying? You know she got mad dudes on her roster. So just play your part. You know what I'm saying? When it's time for you to get called up, you get called up. But you told Brandon, play it smooth. This is one of Tina's dudes. She, this is the dude 
Tina called because she know he gonna spend a little bit. You know what I'm saying? And, and for a dude like for a dude like Keon, he ain't worried about that. You gonna drop that, man? You gonna spend that little? You wanna get your Jade? What are you doing in my house? Changing my t Jade, you gotta go. Jade, you gotta go. I'm not gonna lie, right? I messed up on this lot pretty bad. Um, <laughs> I put the spa right because we're gonna take it to get her nails done and stuff. I put the spa here. And they made it this double skyscraper building, bro. I'm not going to lie. I mean, it looks kind of fire because I created a whole new height. But let's see if this even works. All right, man. So we here at this nice rooftop spa that I literally just cooked up out of nowhere. Like, I swear, out of nowhere. It's a nice little rooftop spa. You know what I'm saying? It's a cool space. I didn't make this, though. All I did was put this on the rooftop and I put this little pen link thing on the floor. But I didn't make this building. Let me show y'all who made it. All right, so this is Newcrest number 11 spa made by It's Leander. You go ahead and look up It's Leander on the gallery. You're going to find it. Um, pretty much, you should have all the packs that um, you can build with. If you don't have all the packs, I'm sorry. With the main pack, you need a spa day. But other than that, bro, I'm not going to lie. I'm a gallery goon. I'm a gallery gangster. I got to do what I got to do. You know what I'm saying? They're not going to hate on me. I got to do what I got to do. I can't build, so best believe I'm downloading them. The gallery is one of the best things that Sims has ever put in this game. Either way, let's get back to this date. I'm not going to ramble because I can go for 30 minutes. But look at him, man. They out here chilling. Keon out here with a what, little pistol in a pocket. He's never lacking. <laughs> he's never. And he got Balenci runners, my G. Oh, now he's touching money, though. That trap life for real. Trap life for real. Y'all know about that. Y'all remember... um life of a drug dealer <laughs> we're not gonna talk about that we're not gonna talk about that you're gonna get me canceled life of a drug dealer y'all remember that this is the makeup for it. what's up with tina though tina looking good though tina a brain boosting yoga class begins in 30 minutes please notify the yoga instructor if you wish to participate listen we ain't doing all that yoga stuff look at him he walking lazy off the walk he walking lazy off the walk oh my brother let me see his attributes what let me see drink <laughs> by changing to that robe okay what drank purple from doing drugs and then stoned from the og kush <laughs> what's up tina you ain't gonna change or nothing tina came here not to change what's up a girl all right should we go to should we hit the saunas after i think we should hit the saunas after but we're gonna have tina change into her robe um and then we're gonna have them sit down and chill yeah we're gonna, we're gonna have them sit down and chill here yeah him and tina I'm going to him and Tina sit down and chill. But somebody was telling me about the steady seat mod. I think that was Noor. Somebody was telling me about the steady seat mod, and it seems like a gold mine, bro. It's a literal gold mine. Um, so, yeah, man, I got the steady seat mod now, so it should be able to allow me to sit Sims a lot easier. Go ahead and sit down, bro. Oh, my God. He's really here leaning, though. Yo. <laughs> Yo, he looks like he needs help, bro. Oh, my. You making a fool idea, yourself, my brother. Not worse than to do with the bad haircut, but yo, this is OD. Where Tina at? Tina, where, where Tina at? Oh, she hopped in the water. Tina, you're not playing. Oh, okay then, my boy. Sit, sit here. How did she sit over here? What the heck? What is that? Yo, how does this get done? Does... I've never seen this animation before. Have you seen this? Yeah, because I've never seen this before. This is actually crazy. Go ahead and talk to her. My boy be like, yo, what's up with you, though? How you doing? You know what I'm saying? It's good to, it's good to see you. Hold on. Let's go flirt. Flirt with her. Um, exchange. Nah, nah. I compliment her appearance. Like, dang, that little that little lime green bathing suit look fire on you, though. You know what I'm saying? She's like, oh, thank you. This and that, this and that. But, you know, I had to get my nails done. If I had my nails done, it would have really, like, completed the whole entire thing he's like nah i feel that i feel that you know what i'm saying um compliment personality go ahead tell her like i really like how you how you value taking care of yourself you know what i'm saying like i don't meet a lot of women like that that's so up on their hygiene you know what i'm saying i'm glad you're really on that she's like yeah you know so some i try to focus on you know you know yo keon hello ask her what that booty do though i'm sorry okay um let me see make a move make a move make a move make a move, make a move. Make a move. Make a move. We right outside the pool water too, so why not? You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, shorty, what's up? You know what I'm saying? Come here, you mad far? <laughs> I right, hit her with, hit her with, hit her with a kiss, hit her with a kiss, hit her with a kiss. Give her admire and kiss, admire and kiss. Can you do that sitting down? Or you gotta stand up for that? All right, cool. Either way, let's go ahead and I want to get them the massages too. But hey, man, I gotta see this animation. Their very first kiss. 
Show do you know what the deal? Wait, dang, kiss. Stop playing. Stop playing. Physical. Come on. Hug and surprise kiss. It's gonna let me do it. Oh yeah. Give her, give her a kiss to my boy. Like it's a nice little hug. Like yo, I appreciate you. You know what I'm saying? I'm glad you let me take you out and stuff. She's like, oh yeah, I'm glad it came out. Like, you want? Oh oh. He said, oh sure. I didn't know you was like oh. Then he's smiling. He's like, damn, why you could have just asked or something like that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> You had to hop up on the bed like you, you could have just asked, you know what I'm saying? All right, both of you, huh? <laughs> I want y'all to get some massages right here. Request a manicure. Ooh, yeah, though, I heard the male, the male dudes, that the male um, nail guys, whatever, whatever they call it, I heard they go crazy when it comes to the nails. The, the, the men's is looking better than the women's is what I'm hearing. That's what the ladies are saying. Did it work? Okay, pick a style. Ooh, what, what color do you want on the hands? You know what I'm saying? Go ahead, go ahead and get the ooh. Let's go white. Let's go white. Let's go white. Let's go white. Oh wow! Look at that! Look at that! Yeah, I've never played with the spas before, bro. This is a hit. Oh my god, this is a banger. Go ahead and enjoy yourself, sis. You know what I'm saying? Hey, Keon, paying for it. You know what I'm saying? So go ahead, and get the whole soak. Tell him put the Epsom salt in there too, and you want you could do all that. Uh, acrylic, all that other stuff you want to do, all that acrylic stuff, you go ahead and do that, man. Keon, what's up with you, bro? You over here letting her sit down by herself. Hold on, you over here letting that lady sit down by herself, bro. In the meantime, though, I'm going to be looking at this because this is actually crazy. Nothing like a spa day. He's paying for spa day. Hell yeah. <laughs> That's that move where he paying for spa day. You go, ahead and, you go ahead and enjoy that, Tina. You know what I'm saying? She was like, That's the dude she's talking about. What, what's that song? I gotta wait blood on my roster. You feed me pasta and lobster. <laughs> I saw she was like Keon. Keon the dude that be feeding her pasta and lobster, bro. I'll tell y'all that. <laughs> I would not lie to y'all about that, man. I'm telling y'all the truth. Oh my god, we gotta get his needs right. And this is why I love UI cheats, because I could just cheat my way through the game. Look at that. But yeah, they have a pretty interesting relationship with them. It's just purely on some like straight. All right, you give me money, um, you let me smash. That's pretty, <laughs> that's pretty much how it is for both of them, bro. I'm not going to lie. Like, she cool. She getting taken care of. You know what I'm saying? That's one of the dudes she knew on her roster. That's probably her favorite one, though. Keon probably, because she got a couple dudes on. She, she, yo, Tina low-key got connections. Y'all are going to see along with um Thing series that they really do have connections. You know what I'm saying? She really do got. Oh, what's wrong with bro? Oh, my God. She really do got connections. You know what I'm saying? So, she just, um, how'd that, how'd that go, shorty? Oh, look at that. She got the white on her nails, actually. Oh, that's crazy. That's actually crazy. All right, so I think the both of them are pretty much done with their whole hammer. Is she farted? Yo, funky ass. Julia, you nasty as... All right, man. Let's just go sit down in the sauna. I wanted to hit the sauna before we dip. That would have been vibe. Let's go to this one here. All right, relax here together. Can we turn on that sauna? You know what I'm saying? Relax nude. Y'all trying to get me to act up, EA. That's not even EA. That's the mod. Is that EA? That's not... Is that EA? No. Look, the land grabs. Oh, I thought y'all was finna take it. What? The way that I was finna... Nah, don't even come in here. Don't come in here at all. Both of y'all. Don't don't come in here. I had to lock that door real quick. You know what I'm saying? Because I want them to enjoy their little, you know what I'm saying, sauna time. Because what's the point of being in a sauna if y'all can't get the sauna together alone? You know what I'm saying? So have deep conversation. Let's try to make this date a lot better. Have deep conversation with her. You know what I'm saying? Try to get gold on that date. Oh, she relaxing. Tina chilling though. Tina really, Tina really chilling though. She good vibe though. That's one thing that I've never questioned about Tina. I always knew that she was good people. So you know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, Tina cool as hell. She just listen. She got her roster, and if that, if that's a make out for a while, go ahead. So you know what I'm saying, shorty. It's, it's getting hot in here. It got me, it make me want to. You know what I'm saying? Give you a hug real quick. Yo. He's like, he's like, he's like, yo, come here, come here. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, yo, Keon, Keon, give it that look. Give it that look. He's like, he's like, yo, come here, come here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he's like, oh yeah, look at that's that. <laughs> sauna vibes. Listen, steamy sauna, steamy sauna session, steamy sauna session, steamy sauna session. That's a steamy sauna session right there. Sheesh. Listen, hey, you know what? Hold on, I got some new animations in this piece. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see what I got cooking up. Hold on. I can't even do it. But you know what would be best for them, right? If he goes ahead and hits it with the, you know, what I'm saying the wicked. 
ask to be casual partners. If they can ask to be, you know, get that established, like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, I really enjoy kicking it with you, but, you know, I'm trying to keep it on some casual. You know, I ain't really looking for a relationship or none of that. You know what I'm saying? Tina, Tina, what you say to... Okay, hold on. Can y'all stop making out? Like, stop eating each other's face for two minutes, bro? Please? You know what I'm saying? Ask her that question, though. Like, you cool with us just, you know, keeping it cool? She's like, yeah, I'm cool with that. As long as you keep playing for my... <laughs> as long as you keep paying for my manicures and pedicures, she cool with it. <laughs> hey, man. He said he got to call Samaj, though, because Samaj called him earlier and told him to call back. So he got to call Samaj. I'm going to go ahead uh, let me see. chat with Samaj. Samaj right there. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna lie, I really like this little sauna thing. Hold on, what's the phone call coming about? He's like, "Yo, Maj, what up, bro?" He's like, "Yo, listen, me and uh, me and Dilo, bro, we at the skate park. You gotta pull up." He's like, "Bro, at the skate park right now." He's like, "Bro, it's 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 live, bro. There's people there, mad college students. We about to get live, bro. It's the word." He's like, "Damn." He's like, "I'm I'm on a date right now." He's like, "Bro, anybody care about that, bro? Pull up to the skate park." He's like, "I right, bet I'm there." Listen, when the boys call, the boys call. We must go, Tina. It's been real hanging with you. I'm not gonna lie, Tina. Um. Oh, he started. He started smoking the sauna. This is why we can't leave roll joints in there. This is why we can't leave roll joints in there. Listen, we gotta go. We gotta go, my boy. We gotta go, my boy. Come on. All right. So this is apparently the spot they want us to pull up to. This skate park here. It's this huge skate park. I'm not gonna lie, but it's weird because it's a skate park and then it's a bar, like downstairs. So it's looking like a movie. I'm excited to see what it has to offer. Oh my God, where'd y'all ride? Where did y'all go to? Oh my God, you guys literally decided to ride out the park. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that skateboard is so cool though. Good skating fit though, my boy. I'm not gonna lie, come over here though. Come over here, come over here. Bike here together. Hold on, Keon, I don't think Keon can even relate. Keon, you can't even bike. You haven't got a bike on, my brother. Either way, pull up though, hold on. I'm seeing some shorties in this piece. Hold on. Who's this though? Get, 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 say, say a little hello though. Attempt the introduction, my boy. Go ahead, attempt the introduction. She thinks she's a little celebrity, though. We're going to have to see what's up with her. He got that. Dang, he got that pistol on him in his pocket. And who is that? Ooh, we. Ooh, we. Good morning. <laughs> Uh, woo, 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 woo. she tough though she tough though hold on all right so the main thing is i want i want samaj to go over here right and i want him to kind of start vlogging a little bit to vlog oh bino's here too look at bino man being social talking who's that stephanie powell she cool oh damn okay damn we got some what these are all college students this is a college hangout so you guys are going to be really really involved with the college students around this time. I'm not well with this series because the college students play a huge part in here. Um, my boy, I want you to talk to this girl. What's her name? Miko Miller. Give her a friendly introduction. Can you give her a flirty introduction? Like, you know what I'm saying? And then Samaj, when you get over here, right? Oh my God, he's pulling back up. You guys are scaring the hus. You guys are scaring the hus. I have a drone here and I want to begin a recording of begin a recording of yourself so begin a recording right here what's keon doing keon what you doing you waiting for thing hold on hold on talk to at least hold on there's a little shorty here a little shorty hold on stephanie romance though hit her with a flirty introduction like word like you know what i'm saying excuse me miss excuse me miss flare bottoms <laughs> you know what i'm saying she don't like bananas oh how you doing it's nice to meet you you know what i'm saying my boy talking to her through the gate he's like yo shorty hold on i'm gonna come talk to you don't leave yet don't leave i'm gonna come talk to you <laughs> That's real though. Affection. Yo, I think he's selling. I'm not going to lie. Hold on, hold on. Affection. Give her a gift. Give her a gift. What you finna give her? A friendly gift? He finna, he finna give her some, he finna give her some, some za, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? He finna give her some za, like a Ziploc bag. Should I give her a whole zip? Nah, zip is crazy. I'm going to give her a joint. <laughs> you ain't getting much more than a joint for me. I know you're in college too, so that's the wave. That's for you. You know what I'm saying? Like, look. That's for you right there. So, oh my God, I appreciate. So, oh my God, I appreciate it. Wow, you you be dealing, you like, be dealing and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? With you in school, she's like, yeah, I'm in school. I'm like, oh, word. Okay, cool. Okay, you see, you on your little, you know what I'm saying? You on your academics. I respect that though. You know what I'm saying? Me, I'm quite, the, I'm quite the gentleman. I'm more of an entrepreneur type of guy. I don't really do all that school stuff. You know what I'm saying? I'm glad you don't think my llama jokes are getting old. I feel like you just get me. Kiss her hands. 
My boy, you, you, I'm not gonna lie. You two for two. Oh, oh, she giving you a hug too. You know what? I think you got it. I think you got it. Hold on, let me see. Let me just, okay, exchange numbers real quick. Get her number. And after that, I think you're good. What happened to you with that girl? Oh my God, you sold? He sold. I think she left. I think she left, bro. Damn, bro, she left. And there's nobody down here at the club part. She left. What is that about? I feel betrayed, bro. I ain't gonna lie, my boy. You're definitely gonna have to add her to the group before you dip. Well, before I dip. Because, you know what I'm saying? You chilling, you doing... Oh, I can't add her to the group. Ooh. Make active, have crushed. I can't even do nothing with her. Damn. She, oh, why she put the hand up though? She acting weird, Stephanie. I'm gonna let you leave, yo. I'm gonna let you leave. <sighs> she weird. All right, so one thing about Samaj, right? He has this drone that's recording him, so I want him to get some really good content because you guys know he's a content creator. We didn't even get to talk about Samaj, but he's gonna come over here and talk to his boy Montero real quick. Uh, Montero, you a drug dealer? Hey, man, but they go to school together, you know what I'm saying? So um, he's gonna go around, he's gonna get to talking to his boy Montero um i want him to get some really good content i want him to get some really good content for today because if he doesn't that's a bummer bro that's a really big bummer <laughs> look at my boy here getting the party started trying to get the tap going type stuff go ahead go ahead it works a word you got it let's go look at him. he's filling up cups oh my god he's a beast he's a beast you about to grab a drink oh he's cold he's cold <laughs> he's cold he's cold he's cold what's that porter oh you're from porter Yo, yo, my boy, you definitely gotta come over here and get a porter, bro. Get a porter. Keon, come here and get a porter. Oh, he about to talk to a little ting. He about to talk to a little ting. Wait, what he about to do? Play ping pong with a little ting? Go ahead, my boy. All right, my main goal is to get Samaj good content for tonight. So, Samaj, you got the drone recording you, right? So, we're going to make this a public interview. He's like, yo, um, <laughs> tell a funny story. Ask him, like, yo, my boy, would you rather, um, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, I got to think of a good question. Would you rather, um, would you rather, would you rather, would you rather? Uh, damn, hold on, I got to think. Um, oh, got it, got it, got it, got it, okay. <laughs> would you rather, <laughs> would you rather suck a foot or let your mind do pass? He's like, oh, damn. Nah, you got, I'll give you time to think about it. I'll give you time to think about it. Hold on, ask me a question. That's, that's a question, that's a question. But he's like, he's like, oh, are you going to do this public interview? He's like, yeah, I'm going to do it right now. You ready for the question? He's like, he's like, yeah, I'm ready. Just don't ask me nothing crazy, though. He's like, all right, I won't ask you, I won't ask you nothing crazy, bro. I got you, bro. He's like, would you rather lick a pickle or let your mom die? <laughs> no, I'm right here thinking about would you rather let her lick your pickle or let your mom pass? Like, <laughs> he's like, um, damn, now you got to think. He's like, you got to think about it, though. If you lick a pickle, it's recorded. You know what I'm saying? He's like, uh, I'm not going to lie. I'm looking at pickle, bro. I'm not letting my mom pass, bro. <laughs> and it's on cam. It's on cam. <laughs> it's on cam. He's like, you know what? Look, it's my dukes, though. I got to do it. You know what I'm saying? He's like, you know what? I ain't mad at that. I I'll lick a pickle for my mom dukes, too. <laughs> Yo, I'm crying. Okay, somebody see if you get some other content. Who's here though? Let me see. We got the DJ headliner. Bino being social as hell. I didn't know Bino was gonna pop out tonight. But look, bro, we popped out. <laughs> well, let me add Bino to the fam. I you know what? I you know Bino. You know what? Bino, I'm gonna let you rock because you're doing your thing on your own. DJ headliner, what's up? Control panel, set the volume to high. What's up though? Oh, I'm not gonna lie, Keon again. Hold on. Okay. Is there any is there anybody over here? Oh, Miko's here. She's back. Where are you at, my boy? Oh, he's back. He's back. He's back. He's back. He's back. All right. Talk to her. Talk to her. Talk to her. I didn't know she was back. Hit her with a friendly introduction. Hit her with a, hit her with a friendly introduction. You know what I'm saying? Or hit, hit her with a flirty introduction. Hit her with a flirty one. Hit her with a flirty one. Right there, my boy. That's what I need you to do. Right there. I don't need you to do that regular one. Hit her with some piff. Give her some good riz. As the predator go ahead and stalks his prey, he gets closer and closer. Montero, don't do it. He gets closer and closer. He's like, you know what I'm saying? I really like your eyes. You know what I'm saying? Romance skill. Let's go. She's like, okay, I like yours too. You know what I'm saying? Let me see. Let me see his eyes. What his eyes look like? I want to see what his eyes look like. Hold on. His eyes barely open. You talking about, I like your eyes too. She lying. Off the rip. We know she a liar, my boy. Hold on. Hit her, hit her, with, some, hit her with some riz. Hit her with some riz. Romance. Physical intimacy. Flirtation. Um, ask if she's single. You know what I'm saying? Bino, do not CB me right now, bro. What do you want to call this video? Uh, skate park vlog. Skate park vlog. Okay. We got the vlog going on. 
All right. In the meantime, my boy, I need you to start recording again. We need to get you the most content because the thing about this guy, right? He has school. He goes to school, but he don't like school. Begin recording. Okay. He don't like school. So Samaj, he'll be really, really like going to school at one point, then he'll stop. Right now, he's not going to school and he's still having to pay for it. Oh, she's single. What? Go ahead. Hold on. Exchange numbers. Exchange numbers. Flow her some more. Come over. What? Hold on. Bino. I'm not going to lie, Bino. You're killing me. Romance. Hit her with some more. Flirt. He's like, damn, you how you doing? You came over here to do homework? Are you serious? You know what I'm saying? I'm a, I'm a tutor if you want. I'll take your number down. She's like, um, yeah, you can take my number down. Let me see what she, let me see what she say. He, he shot her a text. Let me see what she say. She's like, she try to act hard to get. She, she know, oh, she think my boy cute. Okay, listen, listen, I'm not gonna lie, right? D-Lo, you're in a weird situation because you living with your BM, but you're talking to the other ladies, you know what I'm saying? And you know, low key, she wants to get with you, you know what I'm saying? He, he's gonna tell you, he's like, yo, I'm really attracted to you. I'm not gonna lie. I don't think I've ever seen a woman like you before. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? She's like, she's already trying to do her homework. She's like, stop. I'm trying to focus on my homework right now. <laughs> listen, we don't care about none of that. Homework, schmomework. You know what I'm saying? Hold on. Give her a flirtation. Come on. Ask, ask if y'all can go dance together. Come here. See if y'all can go dance together, bro. Hold on. See if you guys can dance together. Oh, I might have to close this group down. I'm not going to lie. I know it's a boys gathering. I know it's a boys gathering, but I might have to close the group down. The group. Bada bing, bada boom. All right, now I want you to dance together, bro. He's like, yo, come on, like me and you, let's, let's go chill. There's no need, no need for you to be doing homework right now. She about to pull up. She about to pull up. Y'all having drinks at the place too? Keon, what's up? Oh, Keon over here vibing though. He wasn't really looking for the things. He did get a girl's number though. He got a couple numbers. He got that blonde girl he was talking to his number. And he got Stephanie number. What y'all think? What y'all think? <laughs> he vibing. Oh, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, 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 oh okay. She she wanted uh she free spirited. Okay. Um we ain't gonna we don't judge. We don't judge. You know what I'm saying? We don't judge. Um Damn, she weird. Um I don't know. Oh, oh, oh. And I busted down with a dutty wine. Oh, okay. In the bait pants? Oh. If the thing moving in the jeans, it's legitimate. If it's moving in the jeans, it's, oh, she got the waist beads on too. Oh, no, she fly. She fly. Miss, miss. Miss, you're going to hurt somebody, miss. Miss, you're going to hurt somebody. Oh, my God. It's like 3, 4 a.m. All right, flirt, 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 flirt. Aaliyah's finna be tight when he comes back. You know what I'm saying? She's out here flaring with the boys. <laughs> affection, affection. Okay, okay. Hold on. Okay. Oh, she. Oh, she's not playing. She's not playing. Talk. Okay. Ask her pickup line. Give her a pickup line. You know what I'm saying? Like, what? What could I do? Oh, oh, she looked like she in pain. More kisses. What's up? Ambitious. Hell yeah, he's ambitious. Samaj, did you get another vlog going? Oh, he's getting another vlog going. Look at that. He's getting some good content on ping pong at the skate park. I think he got to get drunk next, but we'll do that at another time. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I think d is making a pretty good impression. Oh, he, he messed up. He messed up. Too much flirty. Ask her ask her about her. Damn, who was that, though? The low on battery needs to recharge. Allow some time before next use. We got some good content, though. Next time, I'm just knowing that we got to have two drones on hand. But Keon, I think you just about good. Keon, just about good. He met two girls, got some numbers. d over here chilling, vamping late night. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Samaj? Samaj might be Gucci too. We're gonna make Samaj go home. Stop the recording. Skate park vlog two. Skate park. Wait. Skate park vlog two. There it is. That's how you do skate, right? That's how the cool kids spell skate. S K eight. <laughs> skate park vlog two. It's another college student. Are you feeling her or what, my boy? I I wish I would stop. Oh. He is, he is, he's like, he's like, come on, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, physical intimacy, what's up? More kisses. Um, more, more kisses, what's up? Steamy kiss? Damn, I don't want, I don't want to hit her with that. Hold on, embrace her though, embrace her, embrace her, give it, show a little love, you know what I'm saying? I just want to see if she want to dance though. You know what I'm saying? I'm just like, you know what I mean by dance though, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't trying to rush, he ain't trying, he's like, I ain't trying to rush nothing with you, but I just really think you're cool, you know what I'm saying? Ask her, ask her. Ask her how what's her what's her what's her loadout on COD? Cause she seemed like she cool, but let's really test her. You know what I'm saying? She's giving him the puppy dog eyes. Oof. He's like, so what's your loadout on COD? Like when you're playing COD, she's like, oh, I go AR and SMG. He's like, AR SMG. She's like, yeah, I, I go fast. I don't do that stupid slow stuff. He's not feeling her strategy. Oh, he's feeling the strat. He's feeling the strat. He's feeling the strat. Hold on. 
Oh my god. Okay. Well, we met a new fiery little thing. She just like, I gotta go. She probably gotta go to class. Fiery. He's like, yo, bro, you wouldn't believe who I just met, bro. Some cool, some cool. I had that open the whole time. Hold on, hold on. Talk to him now. Talk to him. I don't want to play ping pong. Let him know who you met. Let him know who you met. Before we end this episode, let him know who you met. You know what I'm saying? My boy, Samaj. Chill out. We're not playing ping pong no more, my brother. We're not playing ping pong no more, my brother. Talk to him. He's like, yo, bro, you won't believe who I just met. He's like, some Asian thing, bro. Yeah, he likes deep thoughts. He's like, he's like, he's like, Asian thing. He's like, I'm being dead ass. He's like, bro, not even an Asian thing, bro. She was a Blasian thing. He's like, bro, you're telling me you met a Blasian thing? He's like, bro, she was bad as hell. She had like this curly, like braid bun thing. And she had this yellow bag, bro. I don't know if you know her or something. I think she went to the college or something. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? She was cool as hell. He's like, oh, she was bad. She was thick too. He's like, yeah, she was thick. Then a snake, and she had these bape jeans on. The swag was there and everything. Bro, I think I found the love of my life, bro. He's like, congratulations, my guy. I'm happy for you. Um, let me see. What's her name? Miko? Is her name is her name Miko? I mean, I hope you got her name. If her name is Miko, it's like, like that's her name, Miko. She go to school with you? She, bro, she, I, that's the one for me, bro. That's the girl I've been looking for my whole entire life. A girl with swag, a girl who's cool, who girl plays video games, and she got swag. Let's not forget the swag, bro. She's literally the one for me. There's no other, there's no other woman for me but her, bro. I need you to, I need you to set me up with that. He's like, hold on, hold on. Me and Miko is cool, but I can't do all that. He's like, bro, listen, you could do anything. If you really love me, bro, you put me on. He's like, for sure, for sure. If you really love me, bro, you put the final exams in an hour. Oh, Samaj, you're cooked. Samaj, you're cooked, buddy. Samaj, you're cooked. Oh, my God. Yo, Samaj, you're cooked. Oh, my goodness, Samaj, you're cooked. He's like, listen, bro. If you really like Miko, I'll try to pull my strings and see what I can do for you. He's like, no, you won't. <laughs> yes, I will. He's like, no, you won't. Yes, I will. <laughs> what the hell, bro? It's annoying, man. All right. Samaj, get out of here, bro. I don't know if you can even go home. You know what I'm saying? But Lori Harvey here? Lori Harvey, what the hell Lori Harvey doing? Hey, Lori Harvey. Either way, this is a weird way to end off the episode. Um, Lori Harvey and D'Lo are playing ping pong. But the boys got themselves in some stuff today. I guess this is kind of the start of their story. D'Lo met Miko. He's saying that's the woman of his dreams already. Samaj got some content. Keon hung out with Tina. And he still got two other numbers. I think this is a fun night. This is a great way to end off the episode is at the skate bar. I think the next way to end off the next episode is at Keon House at a crazy house party. But you guys already know what to do whether you're older or new. <laughs> I want to thank you guys for watching if you made it to the end. And you guys know what to do whether you're older or new. Make sure to like, the comment, and the subscribe button. With that. Hey.